What's going on Clash Bashers? Rocky here today and today is the first of the month which means we have a brand new gold pass. If you didn't see yesterday's video we introduced the brand new hero skin which is a Grand Warden skin called the Clockwork Warden and what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be gemming the gold pass going through talking about all the rewards. We're going to be doing this on CB my second Town Hall 13 because the main Town Hall 13 is already maxed out. This way we can get as much use out of this stuff as possible and we can actually get some of those builders busy. It'll be, it'll be really useful so that's going to be the battle plan for today super simple super straightforward we're jimmy the gold pass we'll talk about all the rewards and then we'll check out the clockwork warden in action here live in the video so if you guys are pumped up for that make sure you guys subscribe and turn on those notifications that way you don't miss any future uploads also if you guys want to use today's comment keyword of the day let's go with clockwork warden i know that's a little bit of a weird one but let's go to clockwork warden which is the skin for the month we'll put that over there and also don't forget to use code bash if you are buying the gold pass today go to your settings more settings and enter code bash remember you do have to enter that every seven days so yours might have expired and there'll also be a link down there in the description that you can click on it and it'll automatically enter it for you and you'll be set for the seven days so let me go ahead let me buy the gold pass and we're gonna go start gemming Alrighty, guys there we go gold pass received we're ready to go if you see here actually uh I, I get a little bit of a jump start we already got to level one so we got the one gem donations if you guys don't know this costs about three thousand gems to do i guess it'll be 2900 since we already got level one but we're gonna go through we're gonna check it out i mean right there we got the one gem donations we got a book of fighting right away so that's really nice uh i don't think we can claim that yeah so we'll We'll worry about claiming that later. Uh, hero potion we can grab. Then we get into the builder boost, which this is going to make our buildings cheaper and faster to upgrade. Then we have a book of spells. So right away we have a couple of books. That's really nice. We have the research boost, which makes our researches cheaper and faster by 10%. Goes up to 20%. Then we have a book of heroes. Wow. We're what? Six day or yeah, we're six in. We already have a book of heroes and builder elixir. 400,000 builder looks that's interesting we've never had builder looks i'm actually excited for that on my main account because i'll buy the gold pass for sure on my main account and play through i'm excited for the builder looks let's go uh so then we have a 10 percent training boost i'm really curious what you guys are going to say about the builder elixir in there because we're i'm assuming if there's builder elixir we're going to have builder gold there's builder gold there we go so 400,000 builder gold that's pretty interesting as well i'm going to leave that right th actually we can claim it no big deal so we get Builder Elixir and Builder Gold. That's definitely new. That's something completely different. We get the bi bigger season bank, which allows us to get uh, loot stacked up throughout the season. We can get up to 25 million, 25 million, 250,000 Dark Elixir. Uh, then we get another Hero Potion and Regular Elixir, which is nice. We get a Research Boost, 15%. Power Potion with some Gold. A Training Potion. So all pretty standard stuff there. Some Wall Rings. I actually I like the Wall Rings on... The gold pass i know that's like a, probably like the worst thing uh, ma maybe not i mean those six wall rings get one of our walls up that's that's nice it saves a lot that's like 4.8 with the gold pass will be 4.8 million gold or elixir saved we get a training potion and more builder elixir wow that's the builder elixir is that's different the builder elixir and gold is super different i like it we get a builder boost there we get a research post or double research potion remember those are now instead of 10 times boost those are 24 times boost so they'll actually take a full day off of your lab time so those are actually pretty good getting two of those they'll take two days off of a lab research speaking of research we get a 20 percent research boost making our researchers cheaper and faster so chugging along here we get 1 million elixir and a resource potion nice we get a training potion builder potion our training boost builder potion and 1 million gold so quite a bit of loot in here we got builders all loot we got regular loot like that's i kind of like that guys i don't know what do you guys think about like the mix of loot do you guys like it i'm sure some people are gonna be like oh my god this is the worst gold pass ever they got builder hall elixir i don't even play builder hall I know someone in the comments is going to be mad that there's Builder Hall Golden Elixir on it. I'm kind of happy with it. Uh, bigger Season Bank. <laughs> Let's go ahead and grab that. Six more Wall Rings. Oh, yeah. Well, give me those Wall Rings. More Dark Elixir. 20% Builder Boost. Oh, I see Rune. You guys see Rune? Okay, so it looks like we're going to get into the Runes. Let's see what Runes we have this month. Remember, last month we had, what, two Runes of elixir one rune of dark elixir one rune of builder elixir so let's see what we have this month we have a rune of builder gold 1.2 million builder elixir jeez we have a rune of regular gold i, I went ahead we, look at this rune of regular gold rune of dark elixir 
plus more builder gold. Look at all this builder gold. Like, that's that's going to help out the builder hall. Nice. Oh, man, I'm pumped. I don't know why I'm so pumped for that, but I like it a lot. Uh, so, our runes, we got rune of gold, rune of builder gold, rune of dark elixir, bigger season bank, and then I think that should be about it. Yep, there we go. And then finally, we'll have the clockwork, clockwork warden skin right here we always need that screenshot that's the best screenshot of the month so there we go we'll grab that brand new skin and we will equip it where's our warden right there primal warden look at that clockwork warden coming in in case you guys didn't see him he's really cool he shoots tesla out of his uh what what, what is he doing what, what is he doing he's like stuck on the wall he, he shoots uh tesla or shoots lightning out of his Tesla. It's pretty cool. He kind of reminds me, I posted this on Instagram yesterday. He kind of reminds me of uh, Mokujin from Tekken. I used to play Tekken a lot when I was a kid. So there we have it. The gold pass. Uh, I, I mean, it seems like a pretty standard gold pass to me. We had three runes in there. Uh, we had books in there. We have tons of gold and elixir. I don't know. It seems like a pretty standard gold pass. It's definitely worth the $5. Like I said, I will buy this for the one gem donations every single month uh the the extra runes the books it's definitely worth five dollars the people that complain about like not getting enough in the gold pass are crazy because like i mean look look at this if we go right in here like you have to get a rune of gold and rune of dark elixir and books like that's twenty dollars right away you're getting all that for $5 plus a skin. So, I mean, it's definitely worth it. Uh, let's go get some upgrades going on this base. Let's see uh, our progress base. Let me go ahead and clear this stiff out. That way we can throw the progress base up. Let's see what's going on on CB. I haven't, this account it gets neglected a little bit. I focus on my main account a lot. So let's go ahead. I do see that our laboratory is open so we can take a look in there. Uh, I do need to move all those collectors and stuff over. All right, so let's see, we have this almost done there. We have this Tesla. I didn't do any of the Teslas. That's kind of weird. Normally I do the Teslas right away. All right, let's get that over there. So let's see, we have our laboratory open with new stuff in it. Uh, I think what I'm gonna throw in here is gonna be the barbarians. That way we can get our super barbarians maxed out. So let's go ahead. Oh, do, oh wait a second, we have a uh, book of fight or a hammer of fighting but we also have a book of fighting so let's do that let's grab let's use the book of fighting on the barbs because we don't have any use for elixir besides walls so let's go ahead and do that we get the book of fighting up there and i think i'm gonna use that hammer on the valkyries yeah let's use the hammer on the valkyries here get them going up and then we can go it through we can get some of this other stuff going let's get another tesla upgrading here Throw that right over here. And then we can go through and collect some of this loot that we missed out on. Uh, so we have Rune of Gold there. Of Dark Elixir with Gold. Regular Elixir. Training Potion, which we'll definitely need that at some point. So let's go grab all of our loot here. Shovel Obstacles, Book of Heroes. So we have two books of heroes. We have that other book of fighting, which we can grab. All right. And then, let's see. We need 200,000 to get our Royal Champion up. Let's see, how much do we have in here? Oh, that's so close. That's so close! Uh, oh my goodness, that's super close. Okay, let's do... Hmm. Oh uh, man, I need just a little bit, guys. I need just a little bit of Dark Elixir to get her going up. Uh, so... Let's see, let's go see if we can just snipe out some Dark Elixir here. Uh, we will go out, we'll test out the Clockwork Warden. We'll test him out in an actual battle. Oh, is Titan's Clouds really bad right now? With the update, I guess that would make sense. So let me go find a base. Let me just get a little bit of Dark Elixir. Uh, we'll train up an army. We'll go test out the Clockwork Warden, and then we'll kind of go from there. All right, guys, so we got the Dark Elixir we needed. I just sniped out. I don't care if I lose trophies on this one. I just sniped out some Dark Elixir. Uh, so let's go ahead. Let's upgrade our Royal Champion here. Uh, six to eight upgrade, 200,000 Dark Elixir. Let's go ahead and get her upgrading. Do we get all the... Perks. Okay, good. Uh, and then let's go ahead and use one of our books of hero to get her going up. And then we're going to use a rune of dark elixir. Where's my dark elixir storage? Rune of dark elixir to fill that up. And we should have another book of heroes. Nice. Uh, we'll go ahead and upgrade her again using the book of heroes. Awesome. Good stuff there. 
Uh, so let's go through here. Let's see. We got Rune of Gold, Rune of Builder Gold. I'm not super worried about the Builder Hall stuff right now. Training Potion, which we'll use. Power Potion. Uh, we have another Book of Heroes, which we're probably not going to use today. But we do have that Rune of Gold in there. Let's see. We have a couple Builders going. We have 8 million gold to spend. We could get two bombs going. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get two bombs upgrading here. Nice. Perfect. And then we can go ahead and we can pop that Rune of Gold. Oh, but we don't have any Builders free. Do we have a book to get anything done? We don't have a book. Mm, let's see. What do we have in here? Book of Fighting. Book of Spells. Okay, so let's uh, let's look at our laboratory. Uh, we can get that rune of gold at any other point. Uh, we do have the goblins that need to go up, so we could have max sneaky go. Yeah, let's do the goblins. That's a pretty easy one. Let's do the sneaky goblin or the goblins, so we'll have max sneaky goblins. We'll use that book of fighting right there, and then let's see. We have three million elixir, so we could just save the rest of the stuff. But let's go out and let's test out our brand new Grand Warden skin. Let me set him to ground before I forget. Uh, and I want to use some mass Valkyries. We're gonna do like Queen Walk slash Warden Walk with some Valks and some Yetis. Uh, this should be interesting. I don't know how I feel about the 10 Giants. Actually, I'm going to take the 10 Giants out. I think that was from an event. We're going to take the 10 Giants out, and we're going to try to make this work. I'll be back with when we find a base. I also got to get my King and Queen awake, and we'll try out the brand new Clockwork Warden. All right, guys, so let's try this base out right here. Uh, I think we're just going to go right up the middle with everything. Let's see, we have a quad quake. Oh, yeah, let's, let's, just, go, let's just go in. Uh, so I'm going to do a little bit of... Yeah, let's do a little bit of a warden walk. Actually, we'll do a little bit of a queen walk. Uh, and I really don't care which way she goes. Queen, go in. I was good. Uh, I guess we should have did the warden walk since we're highlighting the clockwork warden. Oh well, too late now, guys. We should. We should have did the clockwork warden walk. I messed that one up. That's my bad, chat. That's my bad. All right, so I don't care if she goes left or right here. To be honest, uh, I just need to make sure I know which way she's going. Let's see if we can get that down. All right, looks like she's going to go right, which is good, fine, dandy, awesome. All right, so what we'll do is we'll get this all working in here. I'm going to quake right here to get this opened up. And then we're going to try to push everything inside here. So queen, get all that working. Let's get this in. We'll get the yetis out in front, and then we'll run some Valkyries in. So we get our Clockwork Warden, and you can see him. Like I said, he shoots right out of that like, Tesla right there. It's really cool to watch. Uh, let's go ahead and let's freeze right here. Oh, I was a little bit late on that freeze. We lost our king. All right, that's okay. Uh, let's go ahead and let's hit the warden's ability here. All right, nice. Let's go ahead and freeze there. All right, we do have one Valkyrie for whatever reason. We need that one Valkyrie. Oh, and she can go in there. Uh, and then we'll, let's see. I guess we don't really need that. Let's run the RC with the hogs over here. I mean, this is looking pretty decent. Queen's going to get that scatter down. Hogs will run around the outside here. We got Valkyries down at the bottom. We got the Clockwork Warden helping out the Queen right here. This is pretty decent, guys. Let's go ahead and throw the heal on the Hogs here. Real champions following the Hogs. This isn't too bad. This is what I, I've been playing with this in Legends. It's been fun. I have three stars here and there. Let me know if you guys want a video on me using Valkyries in Legends League. Now let's go ahead and throw that sh Seeking Shield, and we're going to get through here for the three-star, guys. Look at that. Three-star with Valkyries and the, the brand-new Clockwork Warden. Look at him go. Oh, he's so cool. Look at him go. Get a Clockwork Warden. All right, he's a little bit slow. But look at that. We get a three-star. Not bad, guys. Not bad. Some decent loot there. Titan's Clouds. Oh, my goodness. Titan's Clouds are bad right now. So uh, I think what I'm going to do is we'll just call it right there. I guess I... Ooh, wait. We kind of need something in the lab, huh? I shouldn't have hit that. We should have... Do I have any more elixir upgrades? I don't think so, actually. What do we have left in the lab? Oh, we have minions in... Uh, skelly spell. So I guess we're just gonna have to farm. That stuff can wait. Uh, I need to get my royal champion max. We need to get the king ma maxed out. Yeah, we're good, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and pop some builder potions, or I guess pop one builder potion. And uh, oh, we still have. Still have level 12 walls. We need to get those up. But hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video, Gemming the Gold Pass. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on those notifications. That way you don't miss any future uploads. There's a small chance I upload again tonight. We'll see. We'll see how this one does. Don't forget to use code BASH. Like I said, there'll be a link down there in the description. You can click on that, and I'll enter it in right in the game for you. You guys have a great day.
keep on clash bashing thank you so much for watching today's video if you did enjoy it, don't forget to subscribe and turn on those notifications that way you don't miss any future uploads of mine and if you did happen to miss yesterday's video you can check it out right over there